Alright folks, welcome back. And before we get started, many of you, at least on the last Skyrim stream, were uh, wondering if, where, how to get this game. It is completely free. If you look at the description of this video, you can download the copy, well, a patch copy for yourself, and enjoy it for yourself as much as you can enjoy Daggerfall. But anyway, this is Daggerfall. And also for the people who are like, what's wrong with Grimma's microphone? Lethal didn't hear any problems. For as consistent as they apparently were in the videos, so, uh... Uh, uh, help. <laughs> we can't help you guys, I'm sorry. Uh, He's uh, using a very nice microphone, it's not his problem. That's right. Uh, should there be any situation in which there is a slight audio degrading quality, which does happen because Skype is Skype, maybe we'll just restart the call at the end of the video. And uh, hopefully that'll take care of the things. If not, uh... Rabble, rabble? <laughs> rabble, 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 rabble. <laughs> you can tell we're in a jaunty mood tonight, folks. That's right. Last week involved uh, many random dungeons. <laughs> many. <laughs> a few. And of course, the one I had the most problems with wasn't random at all. It was Castle Wayrest, which we are currently in. Mm, no. You're in Castle Sentinel. I'm in Castle... S I don't even know where I am, folks. That's how in tune I am with the game. <laughs> totally. <laughs> yeah, well, there you go. <laughs> uh, you had just uh, turned in uh, one of the main quest line, which involved you delivering a painting to Queen Berenzia of Sentinel. This painting uh, contained a little sort of magical interlude by which you saw uh, individuals in Daggerfall livery and Wayrest livery look arguing. And one of the people in Wayrest livery stabbed uh, the main guy in Daggerfall livery. Implying that uh, a Wayrest noble killed King Lysandus. So our next stop would be Wayrest to actually figure out what happened, right? No. Nope. Of course not. Uh, you don't have that many more threads of the main quest line left, and, uh, here's where we get to this whole situation where I'm like, you remember that, uh, that, uh, that, uh, that, uh, oh, god damn it, mistress of King Lysandus that you were told about by Prince Lotan here, and you were given a location for, <laughs> but it's not in your log, and you're supposed to write it down. Of course I'm supposed to freaking write it down. Yep. She's, uh, she's one of the individuals who, uh, carries the next, uh, plot thread. Well, shit. Are you gonna help me with this one, Grimith? Since, of course, I had no cue to write it down, I figured it'd be in our quest log. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I think I'm gonna, I'll throw you this one. The, uh, let's go ahead and, uh, go outside and check the big map. One moment. There we go. You're looking for the Isle of Balfiera. Oh, yes, that was a long time ago. That's... R I thought it was Betany. No. Balfiera. I have no idea where that is. I'm looking for islands. Well, there it is. Yeah, there you go. Now you're looking for, you know, one of the orange dungeons on the map, basically. Uh, if you just, uh... Take a peek. There you go. Dureni Tower, right there. All right, well, I guess we'll uh, travel recklessly by ship since going by a horse would be kind of mean. Actually, it reminds me, uh, <laughs> on our last session, we we wondered if we could actually cross the Iliac Bay from, like, Sentinel over the Daggerfall. And it probably would be possible. It would only take probably 10 hours of real time with my speed jumping across the water and quaffing uh, <laughs> yeah. fatigue potions. See the, the water, all of the water outside a dungeon is not like the deep, you fall in and find slaughter fish in Lamia's water. It's the same, the same water that lethal gets stuck inside. By the way, set a recall. Okay, right outside the dungeon? I can do that. Well, yeah, that way you don't have to backtrack to get out. Uh, so essentially, yeah, lethal could most certainly hop uh, across the water, and there's little patches of land where he could theoretically find a place to rest once he ran out of uh, fatigue restoring ways. But, I mean, that was one of the <laughs> marketed features of Daggerfall. It's such a vast world, and you could travel it all without fast travel. Okay, something's already lashing out at me. I hear a vampire near somewhere. 
Also, we asked you for superhero names for, uh, for Flail Fist here. Now he's all decked out. And, uh, here's some of them. We have, of course, the best one here was the Red Rocket, but of course there's no Red Rockets in Dagger. Well, there's no Rockets in Daggerfall. I'm sure there's Red Rockets in Daggerfall. I've seen a uh, few I, dogs. I, I'm sure <laughs> Lethal Flail Fist will show you his Red Rocket. <laughs> it's more purple, but you know. I mean, he's Red Guard. Come on. <laughs> So you're inside the skillet. <laughs> the heck are those? Got some impaled women up there? At least that's what it looks like from this distance. Right on a red rocket, how can they be impaled? I kind of want to just go over there and see what they are, so that's what I'm going to do. All right. I can totally do this jump. Nope, they are... They're things. Also, people are casting magic at me. It's kind of... Whoop! It's kind of what? Kind of rude. <laughs> Actually, didn't hurt as much as it could have. Stop bobbing. Stop it. <laughs> we need to punch people, and I can't do it while I'm bobbing. Are you guys invisible? There are no apples. Uh, I mean, ghosts and wraiths can fly around, so they could be anywhere. I hear them. It's funny, I took more damage from the fall than from their stuff. Are you magically locked? Nope. Then not a problem. Well, that was a great room, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> that was totally worthwhile. Hi, I'm Daggerfall Row. What the hell? Did that thing just move or am I crazy? I think I'm just crazy. I uh, I thought it moved as well, but uh, what do I know with my frames? It does move. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> what the I love how you can throw yourself around. <laughs> it's great. I didn't throw myself. That thing did things. It did it. <laughs> yeah, see? It's doing things. Right. Wait, so it's a tarp. And it actually killed me that time because I just wanted to display that it could kill me. Yep. <laughs> That's totally what happened. Very weird trap, though. I don't think that one exactly work in real life since, you know, matter does not work that way. Well, well, you have to keep in mind, uh, Lethal, this world has magic in it. I guess that's true. Aha! Hello, can I go through there? Clearly there's something behind there. Clearly. But I don't think that's a tapestry you can just use a sword on. Not like you have one of those. I was gonna say, raw game. Can I... <laughs> Let's see if I can make this humongous jump. Not that I need to, but... Huh. Oh, yeah! You still hurt yourself, but yeah. <laughs> Not much, right? It's definitely a thing. Okay, let's go from the top to the bottom. Okay. Well, that was a good room. Another good room. Am I missing anything? No. Well, just... there was something above the fireplace. Oh, it's just fading in and out of existence. Sorry, I missed it. <laughs> okay, so there is a wheel. Someone's going, ooh-ah! Maybe it's a marine. It's a marine vampire, mistress. Hoo yes, that happens. <laughs> Hi, I'm Vampire. What? <laughs> I'm Vampire. <laughs> she's not Daisy, damn it. That's why she said she's Vampire, not Daisy. Not Vampire Daisy. We have a little loop pilot here. So irrelevant, I have to keep on reminding you of my name so you don't forget it. I mean, it's a great marketing ploy. It's true. No one's you, you... not going to know she's not Daisy. You're not going to forget her name. <laughs> oh, boy. Well, this Dear came out of nowhere. I'm all... I thought I entered the same room I left. No. You're I like, oh, they're like, we... Oh, fuck, it's a pit. Well, let's see where this goes. Other than just a pit. Is it one uh, of those pits I can go down? Maybe, right? Right. The pit of despair. Well, I can go down it that way. A hidden door. The end of a hallway, of course. I was gonna say, I see a thing. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> yes, you're going to have to turn that again to reveal the door. <laughs> I love how like, oh, fuck. I thought I was gonna get crushed, Grimoth. Grimoth, you didn't warn me about this. I wasn't prepared. <laughs> Stop casting magic through the pillars. Rude. Cheat. No hugs. I see you don't, reaching out. Don't cave this place in, man. <laughs> don't you do it. Gotta take the data hearts, of course. Yep. 
And of course you didn't put any of that shit in the wagon before you went in here. I know. I thought about that when I saw my shoes in there. I'll deal with it. I mean, we got like 300,000 things, right? Things being... <laughs> Tamriel bucks? Dagger bucks? I forget what the fuck I called them last time. I mean, we couldn't go with gold pieces, no. Nah, that'd be cheating. Water walking? No, I don't need that. I guess. I'm not even gonna pick up the gold pieces. What the hell is that up there? Clearly a cage. Is there anything worthwhile in it? I definitely hear things going rare, rare. Apparently they don't want me to get to this cage. It'll be fine. Let's see, is there any hidden doors? Just gotta make sure because of course we're still playing Daggerfall. What? <laughs> the game with dick doors, so I guess we'll try over here. Hi, I'm Daggerfall. Close. Yeah, there's definitely something above me. Unless it's on the other side of these paper-thin walls. Alright, let's go ahead and save before we cross the threshold. Holy... Oh, I'm underwater all of a sudden. Although it's not affecting me. You're not... You're not under it. I'm just slightly immersed. They're like uh, shin deep water. Yeah. Okay, nothing else in here, right? Let's check the map just in case. I hate to miss an invisible door, invisible door, a hidden door. Hello. Let me get in there with you. You guys are really not a problem anymore. You used to be a problem. Toga. It's not a healing toga, though, so we can't pick it up. And I should probably rest, or take some Gator Age. Yes. A wise decision. Be a dumb idea to <laughs> die because I'm out of fatigue. Alright. We also have another open door that leads to a small, mossy room. Fantastic. Because why wouldn't it, right? There's just so many auxiliary... I see. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> <laughs> why am I even questioning it? You know what? We're going to be a rebel. We'll go through this side. Okay, we won't go through this side. We won't go through that side either. <laughs> Why you trick me? <laughs> okay, well that's weird. No rebel involved. Hmm. Well, now I'm just confused. Was there any other... Whoa, shit. I was gonna say, all this down here is the water room. Anything... I didn't see any hidden doors on the map. Hmm. And up here, there's no hidden rooms. Okay. Interesting. We just have... In interdasting? Interdasting, yes. It's... Bizarre to say the least. <laughs> the least. Well, uh, Lethal, I'm gonna teach you something new here. Pull out the mouse cursor and click, yeah. <laughs> of course. That one has to work differently from every other teleporter. Just to yep. be a dick. No hugs. That's why I'm like, I'm gonna, you see, not all red brick teleporters work the same. <laughs> well, of course not. That'd be too goddamn easy. Right? That's right. We have a little meeting hall here that the vampires clearly are using. These dungeons are better decorated than thief levels. Well, there's not useless plates and stuff to pick up and goblets to throw across the room. There's not entire basements with wide rooms full of nothing. You say this, and then we walk into this room. <laughs> I'm just saying, thief gold levels remind me of Daggerfall dungeons. Hello, ancient vampire. Oh my god, you got me. I was yeah. getting careless. Yeah, lethal got a little too risky. That's why I'm like, ancient vampire. <laughs> Any moment now. It's a cooking it up. There we go. And I have a little magic left, so I guess I'll heal myself. I was gonna say, now that's cure disease. Band-Aids. There you go. Very handy. You usually don't use a healing spell to heal yourself. You've been going with the toga. 
the toe goes. I was going to say, I'll switch it up now and again, right? All right. I know you got magic. There it goes. <laughs> Half my life. Stop swinging around, damn it. <laughs> Wee! Well, at least there's still some challenges. The regular female vampires can't do anything, but these guys certainly can. It's because they're ancient. They got experience, huh? That's right. Hi, I'm vampire. I'm gonna say, they're not even hitting me. They're just magicating their way through their problems. Some people I'm throw... I was gonna say, some people throw money at their problems. They just throw magic, and it seems to work out for them. <laughs> good for them. Okay, I got paralyzed, but I think I'm all right. Oh, good, there's two oh. of them. Because <laughs> that's what you needed. To oh. fight these guys at once. Mm. You guys having a problem there? Hmm? Yes, you, you are. Do throw them. <laughs> One moment, guys. I gotta use my togas. Since you're, you know, confused at the moment. Oh, yes. Yeah, so I was all, why is my scroll wheel not working? It's because this is kind of a fucking DOS game. I'll eventually kick your ass. <laughs> well, you're gonna have to use your togas to do it. You guys are mean, y'all. I, oh, I wasn't even in punch mode. I mean, you could ignore them since they apparently are stuck inside the pyramid. Can you guys... Whoop! And now I'm stuck in here. I don't have enough magic to do the, uh... The thing I need to do. <laughs> to do the so, water so, breathing. So, so it seems that Lethal managed to, uh, jump into the hole inside the pyramid. <laughs> he did a good job. I didn't. I didn't do a good job. I'm fine. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> You're so proud of me for dying. I'm glad I could help. And now they're going to be unstuck and dangerous. Maybe I'll just run around them. I mean, you, you, you do have all of the speed. It is certainly something you can do. Avoid enemies. Okay. Ow, 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 ow. I was going to say, I can't get one of my mega jumps on. That's what I'd like to do to get up there. Well, you can just take one of the lower doors, or you can levitate yourself. Well, I can't levitate myself at the moment. Let's see, where are mm, one of these low... You can't levitate yourself with your magicka. Oh, hello. Excuse me. You're not a problem, sweetheart. Just watch he kills me. <laughs> that would just be my goddamn luck. Another Anticlair Sir code. We'll go ahead and remove that. It better not be your goddamn luck. You have 200 of it. I know, not just in the level up screen now. By the way, folks, I did not mean to have that happen. That is completely unintentional. I, I don't suppose anyone provided, you know, you know, pro advice on the situation. Like, that's just how that happened. Well, I, no, they did not. I, it'd have to, holy shit. It'd have to be the, what do you call it, out? A face? It'd have to be out my face. It'd have to be the uh, Jack of Trades item that I had equipped for a while. And then the damaged luck that I got from something. And then, of course, my restoration spell. I think it was a combination of those. That'd actually be something I would answer. I, you know, I, I've tried to throw out theories, but I'm not sure what damaged your luck. Short of, you know, one of the spellcasters you fought cat cast like a damage luck spell, which I didn't think they could ever do that. <laughs> That's what I'm guessing. I think it was a lich or something like that. Sounds like, or no, it's probably a wraith. One of the low level wraiths or something. Who knows? Maybe one of you people watching knows. Maybe. Nope, they're, they're too offended by my low microphone quality now, Lethal. They stopped watching. I was going to say, they probably stopped whenever you said that Arena... <laughs> well, we all know that. Right. Arena took place in the Imperial Province, which is all of Tamriel. <laughs> there we go. No treasure. I should Nobody have. Has no treasure. Okay. Going to rest. Wait to get stabbed in the back by a vampire agent. Say, I love how you're like, I'm not just going to rest. I'm going to tuck myself in this corner and face the corner. It's because there's so many bright, you know, bright torches on the wall. I don't have water arrows. And I can't sleep whenever it's light out. Yes, that's the biggest problem Lethal Flailfist has. 
Also, I took that one on the chin just because I could. Someone's, someone's hooahing over here. I hear him. Hooahing! Gunny, is that you? Are you Daisy? You're Daisy. You're not Daisy at all. There you go. You're far chestier. You're too chesty to be Daisy. She's still growing. <laughs> <laughs> She's still growing. Well, she could be. I'm not exactly sure how old Daisy is, to be honest. I see a bunch of fucking teenagers throwing this goddamn shit. Well, she's older than a baby. <laughs> older than a baby. Right. That's true. Hello. Who's in there? Vampires? I never would have guessed. Spooks. <laughs> Spooks. <laughs> they don't have any of those... Well, I was going to say, I can't even remember what those things are called that you use for bionics. Used for bionics. For bionics. God damn it, that's a uh, wrong game. That's Mass Effect. <laughs> for uh, psionics. They don't have any psi amplifiers. Maybe that's right. they're uh, maybe they're chess count. Yeah. Oh 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 up up. Well, he's, well, you you got it half right. <laughs> he is in fact a vampire. I don't even remember what that one's supposed to be. How? Ow, ow. <laughs> I really need to get that spell reflection sometime this century. I, uh, you know. <laughs> you, you're the one who's uh, going into all these fisticuff situations. <sighs> Go around him. Thank you. <laughs> Without any easy way to deal with spells. Yep, uh, he's in a dead end room. Come back so I can jump over you. Or jump around you. Jump around. <laughs> Jump around, damn it. <laughs> I like the part where that idea worked immediately. Now, I think he was just too confused. <laughs> he was too confused, yes. It wasn't just me. <laughs> he probably didn't know why this red guard was jumping on his face. Like, what the hell? I've lived 734 years for this. <laughs> that my face jumped on by some mortal. All right, you're you're definitely in a good place, Lethal. I was gonna say I remember this from your playthrough. Yep. Oh, silly ghosts. Oh, you great. Managed to, you managed to find your way to here, and you're close to the uh, oh. to Lysandus's mistress. Ah. <laughs> the the. <laughs> <laughs> Dagger, Paul, you're rubbing off on me. <laughs> Which is the right switch? Switch, witch. They're probably all the right switch or something. I can't remember, though. I, I mean, you could have just typed in which switch, right? Not, you see, these switches have more than just a one position and a two position. These switches turn 90 degrees, Levo. I know, I noticed that. That's, uh... <laughs> oh, Dagger, Paul, you can't model it differently. I don't even know what I'm trying to accomplish. Oh... Interesting. Right. I was expecting them to just go around, but I guess they don't. No, no, no. It's they, they actually just have two positions. It's they decide to turn 90 degrees for the new position. Ooh, er, nope. Send halt. You have chosen to unlock the vampire ancient. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. I said no. One second. <laughs> no, no one second. You're like Toga! I was gonna say, my dodge stat definitely not helping me there. Where is my dodging anyway? As soon as this loads up, I'll check. Any moment now. Oh, great, we're in this state again. Good moment, everyone. <laughs> mom! It says wow! <laughs> I suppose it also says mom if you look at the right angle. Wait for it. Are you going to do the arrows again? No, you're not. Good. So, great. We have switches, and there's no way of me to know what I'm going to release in here. It's essentially a trial and error to figure out the right positions, which uh, reveals the path that's necessary to get it through this area. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to do this one. I'm hoping that there'll be and a... Try to observe the effects of it. 
That was the wrong switch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you son of a bitch. I'm coming after you. This will definitely work better than last time. <laughs> you exude confidence. But do you exude competence? Yes. I actually got him. I think I figured out the uh, the way, at least for Flailfist, to take them out. Get up right in their face as close as possible, because when I do that, they will not cast magic. I don't know why. They won't. I'm sure they will never prove you wrong at any point. Nope. It's true, they won't. Let's see, what was behind all your stuff? Oh, more stuff. Well, it doesn't, uh -huh. doesn't appear that there's any more, so let's go ahead and hit this. Reveal your secrets to me, damn it. I was gonna say, jack shit happened. <laughs> that you could see. Yeah, it could be on the other side of those. Yep. Hell, let's just switch all of them. Oh, I already got that one. Well, there you go. Is that one not switched? That one is not switched. Or did it change? Are you things rotating on me? Now, this is Daggerfall. They'd never do that on their own. Okay, that's open. That is not open. And, hmm. Well, this is fun, everybody. It's a puzzle. I'm good at puzzles. <laughs> I am. Why are you laughing? Okay. <laughs> that is a good switch right there, it would seem. Oh, lethal's good at puzzles. Uh, maybe. You've seen me play the Incredible Machine. That's a different kind of puzzle. Uh, uh... <laughs> of course, I usually cheese it. I don't think I'll be able to cheese this one unless I... I I've you know... seen you play Bad Rats. I guess that's a puzzle game. <laughs> yes. It, well, it's about the same kind of game that Daggerfall is. Hey! There you go. You made it through. And you thought I wasn't good at puzzles. Yeah. <laughs> Good at puzzles. I should no. I should say good at puzzles. Dot com. <laughs> oh damn it! <laughs> you are not scary. You're just a waste of time. You are also you're a different story. <laughs> he's just a you know. He's just a regular lich. He's just a baby. <laughs> and it, <laughs> that was cheating. He got inside me. <laughs> that was the get inside flail fist spell. He researched it. Yep. He just wrapped he, his ribcage around me, I'm sure. So he's his own spellmaker. What the? You it's are... open. All right, you son of a bitch. Hey, that's not very nice. <laughs> you taffered. You taffer. Ow, my face. So everyone knows who Garrett's name is. <laughs> Ow. And he just fucking nuked himself. I know, the the power of lichdom right here. And you got a fancy dagger for us. It's made out of He's steel. He's like, you know what? I don't even fucking... Yeah, yeah, look at there. Oh, well. I would need your dagger anyway. There she is. She's quite a looker. It's going to say, even outside her portrait, I wonder what she looks like inside. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, she also has a kitty. Not that, damn it. <laughs> Greetings, Lethal. I am Medora Dereni, former sorceress to the Court of Daggerfall. I have an interest in helping you in your aim to exercise the spirit of King Lysandus, but I can do little in my present circumstances. If you would pay a visit to a certain other sorceress, I can lift the curse on Dereni Tower. Will you do this for me, Lethal? Sure, if it gets rid of all the ancient liches and vampires. I will be in your debt, Lethal. Nofaga, the mother of my former Lord Lysandus, is a renowned mystic, but I've heard whispers that the loss of her son has turned her mad with grief. If this is not true, she can and will help me. I need a certain rare item, the horn of a great unicorn, to break the curse in Dereni Tower. If Nofaga is indeed mad, you must, search, you must search her castle for this horn yourself and bring it back to me. I will expect you back in 87 days. You have a time limit for this quest. Better get to it. And, of course, you know, it involves going back to a dungeon you've already been to. Yep. Uh, a dungeon. dungeon. And once you get the horn, you're coming back here. So hopefully I remember the way that I somehow <laughs> got to this location. 
Yes, I, I hope you were paying attention and committing that path to memory, because you're going to be taking it. Well, I'll just follow my own my old rules and I'll find it. Follow the left, except when I get to that room with the two vampires, then I have to find the open door, which will hopefully still be open. <laughs> Even though it's probably going to be several days. Either way, we're going... <laughs> a young courier <laughs> dryly hands you a letter and stalks off without saying a word. I can't believe I had to travel all the way out here for this. This is absurd. Speaking of which, let's go ahead and put some shit in the wagon. Wagon, 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 wagon. Yep. And yeah, everybody can get in the wagon. See, Even this is you. what happens whenever you steal things and then forget about it. I'm sorry, Grandma. Is this thing identified? Nope. No. Are you identified? I know what the rose is. I, uh, I find it amusing that you apparently have the Sanguine Rose in two Elder Scrolls games now. Yep, new and old. <laughs> and of course, this one was much harder to get. Actually, I was reading online on the uh, Days Request, and it's kind of funny. All of them ask you to kill people. <laughs> or things, I yep. guess. Certain powerful, you know, individuals, the Daedra princes themselves are like, well, fuck. You're, you're not going to read the note? Oh, yes. <laughs> I got distracted by the wagon. Thanks for staying coherent, Grimmeth, when I am not. Dear Lethal Flailfist, Queen Acarithia Sentinel spoke highly of you as a brave, able, and unprejudiced Redguard. Her actual words were, a hero. For some time, we've been looking for someone like that. I will not lie to you about our loyalties. We serve the Underking. You remember him, don't you? God damn it. <laughs> if you are a believer in fairy tales and consider the Underking the ultimate force of evil, mm, we apologize for misjudging you. Otherwise, we need your help. You can find me at the Kingsley residence of Mibukam in Sentinel. I will wait one month. God damn it. <laughs> of course. So, huh. Well, I guess we're going to have to have a change of plans because we have 87 days to get to one and then a month to get to this one. So, uh, I was going to advise you to set a recall spell here, but, uh, you receiving this is going to, uh, change your priority, certainly. Okay, well, let's go ahead and make a note. Go to Sajunjin. Because <laughs> otherwise, I'm going to forget. Go. Uh, well, you're going to remember. <laughs> In theory. Clint Eastwood will remember. People don't even know what you're talking about, Griffith, but his, uh, his Skype avatar right now is <laughs> Clint looking down the sights of a rifle. He's aiming right at Daggerfall, appropriately yep. enough. He wants Daggerfall to get off his lawn. <laughs> he's asking the Flailfist if he's lucky or not. And I can assure him that yes, I am. So, <laughs> I just closed that after eyeing that down. Mibu Calm and Sentinel. Mimu Calm? What the heck is this stuff? Uh said fine. Mimbo? I was gonna say, there can't be too many Mimbos, right? Right. And we'll go ahead and go by ship. Now you're looking for the Kingsley Residence. You're also fortified. Fantastic. I have it's probably... You built a wooden palace. <laughs> More dancing. Hello, my red, wo red guard woman. It warms my heart to see you, Lethal. What? I, well, I'm a hero. I set the, uh, the, what am I trying to say? Not the goal, the standard. The standard for all Red Guard that they should uh, amount to, I guess, at least in punching circumstances. Uh, I, is that the residence? I don't think you said the Kuzier. I don't think I did either. I'm probably going to have to ask for a name. Uh, no, that's but it. Apparently it is, yeah. These goddamn Red Guard names. Freaking red. <laughs> what the fuck? Freaking red guard? <laughs> what? But you. Uh, <laughs> try blunt. <laughs> I'll Sorry. try blunt. Whoop. You you killed the woman behind. There. Sorry, <laughs> sometimes I can't control it. Okay. Anyway, you're happy to see me. There you go. You did a good After job. I saw you explode that pe those people, including one by collateral damage. I've changed my tune. <laughs> Northwest, Leo. Northwest? That means we have to go up. There. Uh, for a second, I thought it was a temple. I'm like, what? Okay, Northwest. Sit. And avoid the guards. What guards? Oh. oh, that one. Now he just started saying halt. He's all, hey, there's that guy that just killed somebody. I probably should tell him the halt. Even though it's just a futile endeavor. 
Not like I can catch him. Yeah. Unless he's indoors. Sigh. <laughs> Unless he's indoors. Even then, it's sort of spotty. Okay, here's the temple, so around the other side should be the residence. Okay, let's save here, just in case. West Strat, that, that works, yes. Wait. <laughs> temple floors? I do. You're actually in a residence, legal. I know. I right. just wanted you to know that. You're, you're in one. Actually not up the ladder this time. Interesting. Hello? There you are, quest woman. There's quest lady, yes. Good day, Lethal. My name is Fuvja. <laughs> We're not trying to make fun of other, you know, ethnic backgrounds or cultures and naming traditions, but I don't think Lethal and I can take that name seriously. Although she's clearly not a red guard. Definitely not. I must admit that I am surprised to see you. <laughs> I mean, I sent that courier off, and I, I can't believe he found you. Are you perhaps able to help the Underking in an endeavor against the Necromancers? Ow! Who reward you liberally for the service and provide information you will probably not be able to find elsewhere. This is an essential part of the main quest. Uh, the whole information thing, that is a factually correct statement. The King of Worms will understand. I was going to say, I'm not going to piss off our good old buddy, are we? Well, you're going to make the necromancers sad. They'll get over it, but do I have to accept this actually in the main quest? Like you were yes. saying? Okay, well, then there's no choice. I will accept. You will? Hmm, remarkable. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe him. We had heard you were serving the King of Worms, that he was, like, patting you on the, the head and that you were his pet. <laughs> the necromancers have taken an item of ours, a fancy armband of some value. <laughs> The value is of secondary concern. The true problem is that they cursed this item and gave it to the Blades. If you are unaware, the Blades were once the honor guard for Tiber Septum. Today they are lo loyal to the Empire and Tiber's code, but not always to the current Emperor. The Underking has reason to not wish harm upon the Blades. We want you to infiltrate Castle Ludwig in Yaklan and remove the fancy armbands. Please have this done in 51 days if you want your information and reward. Alright, I can do that. Let's see, can I set a recall point in your house, or do I need to? I mean, I would... Well, I mean, you might have to return the item to her, Oh, yes. one second, I'm leveling up. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind me, guys. Just laughing. Well, we got top strength. We've got top agility. <laughs> I guess I'll start going into intelligence. Although, I guess willpower would probably be, you know, kind of nice to have also, so I can defend against more spells. I really do have enough intelligence at the moment. Although I might not. Hmm. We'll never know. I'll put it into here for now, just because I do plan on getting spell reflection sometime this century. Anyway. Let's see. Yes. Anyway, uh, the the it, the castle, the dungeon you're sent to, is set always. It'll always be Castle Lugwitch, and it's always going to be in your clone. All right, we'll go ahead and throw down one here, then. I'll be back. Now, uh, the Yiklan, or Yikalon, or however the hell that's pronounced, that's another province. Of course, I knew that. Now, where the fuck is it? <laughs> somewhere within the Iliac Bay, or somewhere uh, near the Iliac Bay, rather. There you go. It's up there. Castle la 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 Castle Luck. Oh, it's a good thing you can make these travels so fast on your ship, right? I know, right? And there it is. Snow-topped and everything. The majestic bastard. That is Castle Lukwich. <laughs> right. Let's go ahead and make a save out here, just in case. Uh, I think right will be our, our castle save. Did you want to break the video here? You want to try to brave two quest dungeons in one video? No, you know what? This is a good time. It's a little shorter than some of the 40 minute, vi oh, the 45 minute videos, but I'm sure you guys will understand. If you don't, well, that's fine too. See you next time.